Hello YouTube, it's Balamore here, back again with more blind gaming. We're playing Dark Souls 2, Scholar of the First Sin, and we're about to fight the Smelter Demon. He sucks. <laughs> so, um, we're on take three, I believe. A lot of rolling around and timing. I think I have to do a strategy as melee, at least, to be on his side, on his left side, but I don't know for sure. But without further ado, guys, let's get to it. Yeah, he does that AoE thing. Um, it looked like he didn't get me, so... His jumps are so delayed. I'm like really anxious. My heart is going. He's going flame sword on me. Ooh, that was close. See him doing massive amounts of damage to him. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. He did get me once, as you can see, my life bar, but oh, I haven't been this nervous since the Pursuer. Oh, I'm shaking. <laughs> that was intense. Um, no, it seemed like uh, no matter what I did, I was... Uh, uh, okay. I ran out. I was practicing rolling with uh, other areas. Um, and then I'd come back and I'd get hit. And then I go out and I practice again. And I practice for a while, but uh, I was so tempted to go out and look it up. Um, but he held his sword in his right hand, and I figured it made sense. I was rolling to his right because I'm right-handed. It's just a, or actually his left, but looking at him, it's to his right. Um, that's just what I am used to. So it was not working out. And then when he jumps in the air, it's like so delayed. It seemed like. Every time I rolled, no matter when, I was getting hit dead on. So, it was kind of neat to see that fight, how it played out. Ugh. That really, 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 really sucked. So, let's see here. It looked like this was a fog door. I'm just going to show you guys. Let's see if there's any secret tunnels or doors, I mean. So power stance for the wind. It didn't drag the fight out um, too much just because of the massive damage. And when he was phasing, he he took minimal damage. But at least I could get a few whacks in there. And if you guys didn't pay attention, I know the, the fight was very short. Um, when he jumps in the air and lands with the sword into the ground, move away from him because that's when he's going to do his AoE steam release or whatever. Just uh, heal up quick. So yeah, that was a boss fight. I hope you guys enjoyed that. It took me... I said three. Maybe it was like five times, six times. It, it felt like as much as a pursuer, but I really thought it was going to um, just keep beating me. I got utterly... I Maybe I'll include the blooper on, uh, um, on the end of the video or something, but I got like completely demolished uh, when I first fought him like utter demolished I'd never been beaten that bad before in a video game as far as I can remember just destroyed it was quite hilarious I mean I didn't find it funny at the time but ah <laughs> uh, what a fight I really got to go level I got probably 
eight or nine levels I can go up. So I'm gonna go pump those into my, I don't know if my endurance or my uh, dexterity. This is a dex strong build, so um, yeah, I'm not sure if I'll ever go two-handed. It seemed like all two-handed weapons were strength based. So I might stay. It's just massive amounts of damage I'm doing with power attack and dual wielding. I or power stance, dual wielding. And you know what I'm not doing is my strong attack in power stance. I don't even think <laughs> I'm not even freaking doing it. I'm just doing my my normal. Well, let's see here. Let me get back a little bit. Here's the normal for my offhand. Actually, you know what? Let's go back into the um, smelter demon's room. Who the fuck is that? Oh my god. That's a pursuer. Ooh, let's see if we can beat him. This is a bonus. Oh, oh god. Roll. Oh god. This is intense. Oh, I knew it was going to get me back rolling. I cheated you with it. No, no. Oh, that might end me. That might end me right there. No, don't do it. Oh, it was... Oh, that ended me. Oh, he was so close. Well... Shit. I got cocky trying to get that extra swing in. I thought I might be able to kill him off. Ah, well. At least we're going to start right at the bonfire... Um, let's see what we are seven and a half minutes in. You know what? For the hell of it, let's see if we can get him to spawn again. Oh, you know what? Maybe I should. This is cool. If I just a little more patient. <laughs> Being I didn't kill him, maybe he'll spawn again. It's weird how he—he's still around. I've killed him already. Oh yeah. Ooh. doesn't like when you use Estus. What the hell was that? That was a move I haven't seen before. Oh god. Yeah, I think that ended me. Oh, yep. I'm dead. Alright, well, I won't keep going. I'm going to keep picking at him, though, because I know I can get him. <laughs> well, that was at least enjoyable. <laughs> Maybe for you guys. I think my butthole hurts a little bit. Anyways, uh, thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, little special footage there. I thought I hit my, uh, my flask and get, like, wicked... Um, 
I get way too excited, overexcited when I'm doing this kind of stuff, and uh, I don't know, but maybe he'll drop something good, but actually, I think I beat him once, because he's spawned throughout the game, um, and he drops a Twinkling Titanite, which is useful, but it's only one, so I'm hoping he drops, you know, a couple at least, but anyways, guys, until next time, like, comment, subscribe, and share, and as always, later.